VJs of the world, today's tutorial is about the quick search feature introduced in Resolume 7.19. This won't be a very long or complicated tutorial, but it will drastically speed up your workflow once you have mastered it. Quick search allows you to quickly add effects and sources to your composition. Let me show you how it works. I have added this clip twice and want to add a colorize effect to it. Normally you would navigate to the effects panel, look for colorize, and drag it onto your clip. Using quick search instead, I'll double click on the handle of the clip, start typing, and hit enter. This can also be done with sources. Let's add a linescape to this empty clip. Double click the handle, search for the source, hit enter. Besides adding sources to an empty clip, you can also overwrite existing clips. This process is exactly the same, so let's replace the linescape with a spiral using the same method as before. Quick Search also supports favorites. You can add and remove favorites by using the heart icon. I'll favorite the screen shake effect, and next I'm gonna unfavorite the distortion effect. Simple as that. The Quick Search is a smart menu that knows in which context it is created. For example, I can add audio effects to this clip with audio, which makes sense. But the next clip doesn't have any audio. When I open up Quick Search, I can't add audio effects because they are not usable in this context. We can also use Quick Search in the Composition, Group, Layer and Clip panels. Use the magnifying glass icon in the panel header to use Quick Search. Alternatively, you can either double click the panel header or the empty space below to open up Quick Search. Again, this is contextual, so when I open up Quick Search in the layer panel, it won't show sources because they cannot be placed here. And that was a quick tutorial about Quick Search. Now, quickly rewatch the Quick Search tutorial and take a quick shot every time I say quick, then quickly drop any quick questions you have in the comment section below. Links to the footage used in this tutorial can be found in the video description, and I will see you soon. I mean, quickly.